Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to today's training. My name is Keith Hammond, and I'm with the 12th Judicial Circuit here in Sarasota County. Today's topic is how to use a number two pencil made simple. During this period, I will provide an introduction, identification, preparation, and using the number two pencil. Also, there'll be a summary and a brief opportunity for questions. The first question might be, Aren't all pencils made the same? Well, they're similar, but not the same. So let's look at this chart here. On the top line, you'll see high numbers to low numbers, which reflect the higher the number, the harder the writing core, the lighter the image that's left on the paper. On the bottom line, from low to high, reflects the lower the number, the softer the core, the darker the image that's left on the paper. It is this characteristic that makes the number two preferable for many applications. It's also important to note that soft lead pencils tend to dull more frequently and you may need to sharpen them more often. So how do I know if I'm using a number two pencil? Well, the number two pencil when new has an unfinished or unsharpened bottom, as well as at the top, there is a eraser that's affixed, and while there are many brands and many manufacturers, they all use the same numbering system, which is just below the eraser, and you'll see both here on the pencil and on the slide, the number two. That's how you know you have a number two pencil. The next step is preparation. Because the number two pencil is unsharpened, we must first use a pencil sharpener to, to achieve a point. There is a manual sharpener as well as electric sharpeners. And I will demonstrate this time the electric sharpener. The electric sharpener uses rotating blades to shave the pencil at an angle to create a point. As you can see, there is a nice point on the, on the edge of the pencil. And this is important, particularly if you're going to be doing writing. You really should be mindful when using the electric sharpener, because if not, your pencil may look like this. Using the number two pencil, we start by holding the pencil between the thumb and four fingers, and by gently applying pressure as you move the pencil across the surface of the paper to make your mark. You need to reminder, you need to remember that the pressure applied on a soft pencil may cause the pencil to become brittle or even break. And if in fact it does break, all you need to do is resharpen. Of course, if you make an error, there's an eraser that's conveniently placed at the top. Simply reverse the pen in your grip and move the eraser over the lead on the paper, which will remove the mark and then you can start again. So in summary, number two pencils are the most commonly used and can be readily identified by the numerical marking of a two below the eraser. Before you can use the pencil, it must be sharpened to a point. Soft cores can dull easily, and so you may need to resharpen as necessary. Hold the pencil between your thumb and forefinger and move it across the paper in order to make and, and apply gentle pressure to avoid breaking the point. And finally, if there's an error that's made, you can use the eraser to make a correction. Finally, are there any questions? I'd like to thank you for attending this training and have a good day.